नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम यू इन दिस डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम टूडे इज फिफ्टींथ अक्टूबर इफ बी सी स्टडीज रियलाइज वेदर सो हैवी टू वेरी एवरी एंड फॉल ऑफ दर्डर ऑफ थर्टीन टू फिफ्टीन सेंटीमीटर एंड फॉल रिपोर्टेड ओवर कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश एंड तमिलनाडु इन कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश कवाली रिपोर्टेड फिफ्टीन सेंटीमीटर एंड इन तमिलनाडु पुडुकोटा डिस्ट्रिक्ट रिपोर्टेड थर्टीन सेंटीमीटर इन एडिशन टू दीज टू स्टेट्स ईस्टर्न पार्ट्स ऑफ मध्य प्रदेश कटनी डिस्ट्रिक्ट रिपोर्टेड ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर एंड हैवी रेनफॉल रिपोर्टेड ओवर वेस्टर्न पार्ट्स ऑफ मध्य प्रदेश मध्य महाराष्ट्र रायल सीमा सौराष्ट्र कच्छ एंड केरला माहे विद दीज हैवी टू वेरी हैवी ऑब्जर्वेशन लेट एस लुक एट टू डेनोप्टिक सिस्टम सो वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू सिनोप्टिक सिस्टम इज दैट टूडे साउथ वेस्ट मानसून हैज बी ड्रॉन फ्रॉम द इंटायर कंट्री टूडे दैट इज द 15th October 2024 and simultaneously the northeast monsoon rainfall activity has commenced over south in east southeast peninsular India today that is the 15th October so this information is very important and under the influence of this uh, and uh, there is also a bellmark low pressure area over central parts of south bio bengal and other under the uh, commencement of northeast monsoon and the bellmark low pressure area over central parts of south way of bengal uh heavy to very heavy rainfall and extremely heavy rainfall also likely over especially tamil nadu and coastal andhra pradesh we will see later so the bellmark low pressure area today uh, persisted that is yesterday's low pressure area today seen over central parts of south way of bengal and it is likely to move west northwest wards and intensify into depression over south west way of bengal during next 24 hours and it is likely to continue to move west northwest wards towards the north tamil nadu puducherry and adjoining south andhra pradesh coast during subsequent 24 hours so this is the situation current situation of bellmark low pressure area and its forecast so this system is being monitored by india meteorological department regularly and then formation for this system is available continuously at different uh, platforms including including x facebook our website mosam.imd.gov.in and also over rsmc new delhi website other than this there is a depression over west central arabian sea and that is uh, distance at a distance of 460 km south south east of uh, masira oman so this is another system but this is system is not now important for our uh, country uh, so we are regularly monitoring that well mark low pressure area that is the central parts of south bay of bengal and this depression also likely to weaken gradually into a bell mark low pressure area during next 6 hours so this is the current situation of uh, this depression uh, over arabian sea so this is uh, another system and uh, these are the two systems so again we uh, highlight uh, uh, for uh, today's uh, briefing is that uh, northeast monsoon has uh, commenced over southeast peninsular india today and in association with the bell mark low pressure area over south bay of bengal that is central parts of south bay of bengal isolated very heavy to extremely heavy rainfall likely over tamil nadu kerala and south inter karnataka during 15 to 17th of october over rail sea mind coastal and pradesh on 15th and 16th october so this is update now we will discuss weather warning day by day so this is weather map for day 1 that is red color is given for extremely heavy over tamil nadu and orange color over coastal and pradesh rail sima south in karnataka and kerala here very heavy rainfall expected today heavy rainfall also likely over konkan goa and thunderstorm activity is expected over tamil nadu north inter karnataka chatisgarh and madhya pradesh abc weather warning for day 2 that is valid for 16th of october so red color is uh, now given to coastal and pradesh rail sima and tamil nadu where heavy to very heavy rainfall with extremely heavy rainfall that is rainfall more than 20 cm is expected under the influence of uh, northeast monsoon and the uh, low pressure area that is likely to intensify into a depression and orange color is given to south inter south inter karnataka coastal karnataka and kerala where heavy rainfall is expected and adjoining areas like north inter karnataka goa region where heavy rainfall is likely over the over telangana thunderstorm with light to moderate rainfall is expected abc the weather warning for day 3 that is valid for 17th of october so orange color is now given to tamil nadu kerala and south inter karnataka 
with possibility of very rainfall and heavy rainfall over coastal and Pradesh, Rail Sima, Kong, uh, coastal Karnataka, Konkan Goa, and North Central Karnataka. If we see the weather warning for day 4, that is valid for 18, so the intensity of rainfall will decrease over South and Central India. Only thunderstorm activity is given to Tamil Nadu and heavy rainfall is given to coastal Karnataka. Otherwise, no significant weather warning has been issued for any parts of the country on 18th and on 19th and uh, uh, no warning for 20th and on 21st again no warning has been issued. So there is no significant weather warning during the period of 18 to 20. 1st October 2024. Now we will discuss about the fashion and warning. So under the influence of Belmark Lupus area which is going to intensify into depression. So main fashion and warning has been issued for South Bio Bengal, Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Sri Lanka coast and also coastal Karnataka, the Karnataka coast during next 4 to 5 days. So the shaded area here shown is the fashion and warning where fishermen are advised not to venture into the shaded areas and details are available at our website rsmc new delhi and also our mosom.imd.gov.in you can visit our facebook x and our uh, different uh, uh, other different like instagram also for the updated information and uh, you are also requested to visit our rsmc chennai website and also uh, med center uh, respective med centers of trivandrum bangalore etc so this is update for today. We'll update tomorrow. Till then, Namaskar, Jain, Jai Bharat.